Imagine a blog that is so bright to the point where it can outshine the sun itself in Minecraft. This is glowstone, but with a normal brightness. This is glowstone with 10 times the brightness. It can sort of outshine the sun. And this is 100 times the brightness. So it's about like 1500 brightness in Minecraft brightness scale. Oh, that's freaking bright. Oh my God. Oh, my eyes are in pain. Ah! Now this is brightness 1000 and it is pretty freaking bright. So let's see how bright brightness 1000 is. So we're about 50 blocks away and uh, let's see. Yes, it has no problem lighting this block up. Let's go even farther. Okay, we're about like 220 blocks away from the source and it looks like it is not enough. Maybe it is time to increase the brightness. Oh my gosh, what in the heck is that? And we can barely shine the block. Now, let's look at the block up close. And, uh, whoa. What is this? Why is it shining red and green? What in the heck is happening? This is about like brightness 10 billion or like 100 billion. And yeah, this is what happens. But how would a brightness 1 billion look like an Opera GX? Hmm. Ah! Now, Opera GX allows you to make even more customizations other than that, such as custom background music, keyboard sounds, opening and closing tab sounds, colors and themes of your browser, custom wallpapers, and more. And yes, you can enable and disable individual mods. Want more mods? Check out the GX store. The possibilities are endless. Now, if you look to the left, there are integrated AIs for the browser. Hmm, what happens if I place down a brightness one sextillion block in Minecraft? Your PC will explode, just like when you got more than five Chrome tabs open. Yeah, so your Chrome browser is notorious for bad performance. But don't worry, with GX controls, you can limit the amount of RAM and CPU the browser uses. Now look at the difference. So use the link down below, get all projects today, and import all of your bookmarks and settings because it is as easy as placing down a brightness zero block. Go to settings, sync, import bookmarks and settings, and import. That's it. Thank you, Oprajx, for sponsoring today's video. And now, check this out. So uh, this is a mirror block in Minecraft RTX. And you guys may be asking, hey, Lemon, thanks. Why do you have RTX on? Why do you have this shit on? Well, it's because this does not work without shaders. So I want to make a mirror room in Minecraft and then place down this insanity inside of the mirror room. And I'm pretty sure this is probably going to be a disaster. What the heck? I am so confused. My brain is like, what is going on? And uh, let's place on a block. Ah! Alright, so now I want to see how far the light could travel underwater. So it's really realistic, just like this. And that's because I have Minecraft Better RTX. So it also simulates real lifeness. Ah, uh, this is a uh, brightness 1 trillion block, and we're about uh, 250, and it's really dim at this point. And we're at 350. We cannot see it anymore. But that's probably because we are out of the render distance. Okay, up next, we got RGB glasses. So I want to see what happens if an extremely bright light goes through all these colored glasses. So let's go ahead and place down the block uh, right here. And if we go here, then as you see, everything is uh, chaotic. <laughs> let's go here, blue, and... What? It just blocked it completely. Wait, hold on. Let's do a time set midnight. And then I'm going to block all these blocks like this. After three layers of glasses, it's pretty much dead. So I kind of expected this. So that's why I did yellow glasses. Oh my... <laughs> Dude, no freaking way. That is way better compared to this one. Next up, we got the tinted glass. Let's get it. Oh my god, that is so freaking bright. Whoa. They're glowing red. Maybe the tinted glasses are slightly red. But it only went through... One, two, three, and that's it. Three layers of glasses. But what happens if I make it outrageously bright? Pretty sure this is gonna be crashing my game, or maybe if it doesn't, then it's gonna be crushing my eyeballs. Oh! <laughs> that is so freaking bright. Can we make it brighter? I don't know. Let's try this thing. Oh my god, what just happened? Whoa! What in the heck? I think it glitched out. What the heck is happening? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> that is so cool. 
Okay, let's lower it a little bit because I think it's glitching out. And this is probably as bright as you can ever get in Minecraft without it crashing the game. And uh, let's see what happens. Bam! And uh, holy crap. But we still only have one, two, three, three penetration. That's it. Now, let's try slime blocks in Minecraft. And it looks like we got a one, two, three, four, five blocks of penetration. I want to try something really stupid. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, <laughs> that is so freaking cool. What in the heck? Dude, no way. Let's go to the overworld. <laughs> it also affects the enchantment's glow. So this is what the enchanted golden hold looks like. That's freaking amazing. This is what I look like. <laughs> it's like a gigantic glowing stick. So uh, let's see what happens. Three, two, one. Uh, bam! Oh my gosh. I can light up the entire freaking Minecraft world. But it is extremely bright. My game can't even run it correctly. So let's do uh, something extremely stupid by doing slash fill. This is gonna be extremely bright. Oh! <laughs> so that's 3,000 blocks of glowstones shining at about like one gazillion brightness. And those are clouds. Yeah, those are being illuminated apparently. And uh, if I look at it from down here, then uh, yeah, I can't even see anything. This is what the entire world looks like. I'm gonna go really far away because if I do so, maybe it gets better. I don't know. So we're about like 200 blocks away from disaster and it's still horrendous. Look at this thing. The leaves are glowing. So I've lowered the brightness to about like a million. Yeah, lowered it to a million and it looks way better. Like I can actually see the world. So that's million times 3000, which is 3 billion. And um, yeah, this is what a brightness of a million looks like at nighttime. Yeah, this is nighttime, believe it or not. Oh, what is this? Why is this close to not even glowing? Oh, that is amazing. Okay, and this is brightness 1000 times 3000, which is 3 million. And it is lighting up the entire freaking Minecraft world. This is what I'm talking about. And this village is getting toasted. <laughs> Look at this thing. Look at this, man. Oh my gosh, it's so freaking bright. I'm just gonna run away from this village. Oh, I'm just gonna retire. Wait, no, that's a skeleton, right? I, I barely even noticed that. That's a freaking zombie. How can you see in this freaking brightness? So let's see what happens if I go in this village house. See if it is somewhat dimmer. And uh, this is what the inside looks like. No, we gotta destroy that. That's too bright. Uh, have fun sleeping in here. <laughs> but other than that, the entire world looks pretty normal. Like this is what I will probably see around the sunset. So, brightness 1 million is pretty much the sun in Minecraft. Alright, just before I end this video, let's do 999. Oh my god. Whoa! <laughs> what have I done? Dude, that is freaking wild. That's probably uh, what happens if brightness is negative. So, um... I think the numbers have overflowed and it became negative. Okay, so I've added more zeros to the number and we somehow turned the entire world into a police car. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> Look at it. It's so bright to the point where it's just white. So yeah, oh my gosh. How are you alive? Aren't you supposed to be burning in sunlight? This is like a bazillion times more stronger than sunlight. Oh my gosh. What is happening? Oh my... Oh! My game. Is this grass? I believe so, but it's... Ray. Whoa. I think that's emitting brightness and darkness at the same time. That's probably why uh, it's not that bright, but it is also bright at the same time. So that's why there's like this little things in the ground. So yeah, lastly, here are some more Minecraft modifications that you may be interested in. Power and Dana, thank you for watching, and see you guys in the next video.